What's going on, everybody? Oregon State post game. You know, really, really happy we won. Really, really happy we got our sixth straight win in that rivalry. Six straight now. Um, it, it's an awesome feeling. It really is to win that game. Uh, wish the season could have been a little more, you know, complete. Meaning that we'd be undefeated right now. But if wishes were horses, we'd all ride, right? Uh... Uh, I like the gutty performance our team put on. Granted, we didn't play the best game on offense, and that's partly play calling, that's partly execution. Um, I'm not ready to fire anybody just yet. I want to see another year. And if the same things continue next year, then the doors can hit asses on the way out. But right now, I'm content to uh, give them kind of a pass for a year. But if this up-the-gut stuff continues, Scott Frost should be fired. That's just my personal opinion. That was outrageous how many times he wanted to run the ball up the gut. Inexcusable. But anyway, I'm trying to focus on the positive here. Finish the season strong. We still got one more game left. Um, our seniors have a lot to play for, mainly pride. Uh, another 11 win seasons on the line. I I don't know where Oregon's going to go. There's a lot to be determined in these championships Saturday. There's a lot that could come out like, man, Auburn could go to the national championship and. Oregon could go play Alabama in the Sugar Bowl. That's a definite possibility. I am if I had to bet on it, I would see us going to the Holiday Bowl. I I just to to get us back to a BCS would just be a dream, uh, and then have a chance to play the defending national champions would be even a bigger dream. We finally get that matchup we've all wanted, and it might not be in the game that we thought it was going to be in, but it's going to be in a big time ball game. But um, thank you to all the seniors. Uh, the season isn't over yet, though. You got one more game to go play and finish off your careers at Oregon. I I, I couldn't be happier with the senior class. You know, this this team would have this senior class would have had four straight uh, bowl games. Um, it, it just is a great time to be an Oregon Duck fan. I think uh, everybody wants to dog this team, and I'm I'm trying to look at the positive side. It's still you know, another year closer, in my opinion. You get better when you're tested. And this team was tested this year. Mark Helfrich and Scott Frost and Nick Aliotti, all the coaches were tested. You know, you get better through adversity, in my opinion. I like that this team got beat. You know, it's going to make them smarter. <laughs> if I had to bring out a positive, I'm kind of glad this team got beat. Because it's going to make us better down the road. Next year and the year after that, the, the more tests you have, the, the closer games you have, it makes you smarter. It makes you wiser. Um, you don't necessarily get better by winning by 40 every single week. You get lazy. You get complacent. And I don't want my team to be lazy or complacent. I want them to be determined. I want them to be hungry. And I think that's what's going to put a fire under our young players to go and see, okay, we can't win every game by 40. There are no cupcakes in the Pac-12 besides maybe Cal and Colorado. There are no gimmies. And Arizona proved that. So for me, I would love to see this team come out with fire next year. And, you know, they always talk about one week at a time, one week at a time. That's great and all, but, you know, we didn't prove that this year. So now we have a chance next year to prove that. Um, got a lot of time to recruit now also. This is recruiting season between the last game of the year and the bowl game. Uh, this is recruiting time, and I expect big, big things from our coaches and our recruiting class. I really do. I, I want to be top 15, top 20. I want to get up there. And I think we have the chance to do it. We've been recruiting like hell already. Now we get to focus. Our sole purpose is on recruiting now. I would expect nothing but great things. But that's about it for me right now. I'm going to sit back, um, enjoy Championship Saturday, and you know see where the chips fall and I'll talk about the bull game when we know where we're going. But uh, as always, guys, go Ducks.